All right, in today's video, we have the P. Louise budget box for the month of December. So I explained this before, you always get like a month behind. P. Louise does not take the money out until the end of the month, and then they ship the first week of the next month. So because they took the money out in December, like the last week of December is technically December's box. This beauty box is from the UK, so it comes across the pond. So I literally just got this in the mail. So, if you want to see what I got, hear my thoughts and opinions on the December box. And is it worth the money? Then keep on watching. All right, I turned the light down a little bit. Let me know what you think. Like, if you like it like this or like this. Let me know what looks better for you. Let me turn it down a little bit. I don't know what happened, but I turned the thing off by accident. All right, so it just came in the mail. So over here just has like my address and stuff like that. So let's cut this puppy open. Every month, like I've noticed, is a different price. So it's not a set price. Now you can go in on P. Louise and you can get like just one time box. Or you can get the subscription box where you get it every month. That's what I did. And I think for December, I think with shipping and stuff, it came to about $37, I want to say. So that's what it looks like. I don't know if I like it. I don't know. I got to mess around because you guys know I got a new phone. So I got to play around with the settings. Anyway, so this is what it looks like. Now, let me just be very honest with you. Uh, oh, very quickly. It does have like Christmas theme. So it's definitely the December box. It's very pretty. My very first box, I loved it. We got like three eyeshadow palettes and I was so excited because I've never really tried anything from P. Louise, not even our famous eye primer. So I was like, oh my gosh, we get three eyeshadows. And then one good thing about this subscription box as well, anything new that they come out with, you get in the subscription box before they offer it on their site. So you're one of the first people to get it as well. So that was exciting. However, I wanna say this is maybe my fourth one and they're not as good as the very first one that I got. So I don't know if I'm judging on that. I'm not sure. So let's test her out and see what this is to see if I will keep subscribed to it. How the heck do you open it? Okay. So you get this little thing here and I always have trouble, trouble opening it. Oh. <laughs> oh, tears. Oh, oh, okay. Let's try this side. Oh my God. Oh. Okay. I keep looking to see if my, I got two Beautylish boxes and I cannot wait for them to come in. All right, so here is a little sneak peek. Not too much, and I like to tease a little bit. Stop looking at me like that. I can't help it. And I don't see a card, but then again, I don't remember. Do they come with cards? I don't think so. I don't think that they do with the prices and stuff. I notice a lot of the indie subscriptions don't. I don't know why. But this is a first. Okay, so this is the P. Louise. Well, everything's from P. Louise. This is the I'm Sweet Enough Cups. One spoon or two. No sugar, babe. I think that's pretty cool. Let me know what you guys think um, down below if you like getting stuff like this in a beauty box. I know they do offer this on their site. Let me uh, go on my phone. Let me see how much that is. Oh, they actually have a mystery box right now. It's the New Year edition. Um, let me see how much it is. $32. So if you're interested in that. Oh, they have uh, choose option. Oh, it's from th what? $25 or $40. Okay. It's a skincare mystery box, so I'm not really, I wouldn't be interested in that. All right, where is that at? This says, this, this, this is not the horoscope, horoscope. Is it? No, this looks different. Approximately 10 hours later. 
So they have a horoscope cup, like you can get um, like an Aries. Oh, let's see what the Aries look like, because I'm an Aries. That's nice. Anyway, this is $19, okay? So I'm going by the same price as the um, horoscope one. All right, 20 bucks. Would I pay 20 bucks for this? Probably not, to be honest with you. It feels kind of cheap, but you don't pay that in the subscription box. So I ain't mad at it. I know my daughter will take this. She loves stuff like that. Okay, so then we have four more things. The next thing is, says no such thing as too much bling. So we get a highlighter, an expensive taste. I know we got a highlighter. I don't know if we got it in our advent calendar, I want to say, or did we get in a subscription box? I don't remember, but I do remember getting a highlighter. Let's see if it's the same one. And they are very pretty, their highlighters. Like, I mean, the packaging is just so adorable. Okay, no, I don't have this. This is a little too dark for me, so it has a mirror. I'm going to swatch it only because I'll give this to my daughter. Yeah, it's definitely way too dark for me. And did I show you? Let me show you the. It's very pretty. All right, so the first two things mm, I wouldn't use, so let's keep going. The next thing is this, and what you be? Candy Cane Lane. Ooh. What are you, a blush maybe? I don't know. Well, whatever it is, the packaging is just absolutely gorgeous. Oh, it's an eyeshadow palette. Now, I got one of these, I think, in the advent calendar. I want to say I got, like, a purple one. So, you have a mirror, but you got pinks. Now, that is beautiful, you know, for Christmas. So, I wonder if these were exclusive for, like, the Christmas one. I'm actually wearing um, P. Louise eyeshadow palette today. That is just adorable. I love this. Um, let me swatch it again. Let's see. I mean that look at that. That's just beautiful. All right, that is going in these four colors right here twice. Pretty. I'll definitely have to play around with it and see like, you know, how it works. All right, two more things. Then we have this. This is Bad Butch Energy Juice Candy Kisses. Do you guys remember, like, I love the packaging. We got something like this before and I like went crazy over. So I wanna say maybe this is all stuff like just for this box for December. You should see this mess, I hope, over here. I haven't been feeling good. I was in the hospital the other day for my blood pressure. And I got to clean it. Um, so after I get done filming, I'm definitely going to clean over here. All right. I, I mean, I really do love the packaging on these. All right. Let me open it from the bottom. Okay, yeah. So you get like maybe a lip oil and lipstick, I want to say. Let's see. This is Protect Your Pout Sugar Rush and then Stay Shining and Candy Kisses. Ooh. Look at that. I love how you could put this on your pocketbook. Okay, so, and this is one of those things like this. I just want to see like what color. Yeah, it's just like a clear color. All right, definitely, we'll definitely, definitely be using that. I'm excited. All right, candy, oh, and it smells like caramel apple. Oh, that smells amazing. Now I'm hungry. All right, and then we have this. These are big applicators. All right, and this is like a lip oil or maybe a lip gloss or something like that. Can you even see that? Yeah, it's very sheer, like a pinkish color. Pretty, though. Oh, that smells good, too. 
Okay, I am hungry now. All right, and last but not least is Candy Coated Cleanse Sugar Rush. I never sugarcoat things, babe. I'm sweet enough. Yeah. Oh, a bubble bath. Ooh, I love taking baths. Let me know down below if you do. I don't take them every night. Like, I take showers most of the time. But, like, if I take a bath, let me know. Okay, if you take a bath, do you just take a bath and wash yourself up and then get out? Or do you take a bath and then, like, for me, I have to get in the shower because I feel like I'm just sitting in dirty water. You know what I mean? So, like, I have to get in the shower to wash off. Or do you take a shower first, get clean, and then take a bath? <laughs> Let me know because I'm nosy. All right. I'm having a hard time opening this up. I love how everything comes, like, nice and um, wrapped and everything. Oh, my God. Gosh, I, I think I'm most excited about this. Oh, look at this. I wish this was bigger, though. This is very small. And it smells like bubble gum. Oh, my God. There's a little bubble there. Yeah, it does. It smells like bubble gum. I wish it smelled more like um mature, you know, something. But... Yeah, and I just wish this was bigger because this is maybe it's a sample size. I don't know. All right, so let's recap everything that we got in the P. Louise box. So we got a bubble bath. I don't know why I'm so excited for this. I really am. I've been looking at the Lush subscription. Do you know I have never tried anything from Lush? Nothing, not the soaps, anything. So I'm really thinking about trying that subscription box. Let me know down below if you're interested in that. Um, if you, if I get it, if you guys would unbox it, cause it's a pretty expensive box. So let me know. And I definitely will. All right. So we have a bubble bath. Wish this was bigger. We have a cup here that it says is $19, but it feels very cheap. Like, and I'm not, I'm not trying to be like, uh, what's the word that the young kids say? <laughs> I don't know. I'm not trying to clown on or nothing, but this is something that I would get at the dollar store. I'm being very honest, just the way that feels, or maybe five below. I would never pay almost $20 for this, and that, that's the truth, you know? But that's not what we paid for it in the box, so um, I'll give that to my daughter. I love these. I'm really into, like, lip oils and lip balms and glosses and stuff like that, so I'm really glad to get that. The highlighter is just too dark for me. I mean, I am very glad that they are giving this out for people that are have medium to dark complexions. That's really nice because I can't imagine what, like if my daughter was to get a subscription box and then they're always light colors that make her look ashy. You know what I mean? So I am glad that they are using a different color, but you can always use this as an eyeshadow or something. Do you know? And even the center of your lip, you can make it work, you know? So I love this palette. It's so cute. The packaging is just so adorable. It's called Candy Cane Lane. Do you remember the um, board game Candy Cane? Is that what it was called? I think so. Or like shoots and ladders and stuff like that. I miss that spending time with family and just playing board games. I miss that. So I am very happy to get this. And then what else? Is that everything? Yeah, that's everything. So is this worth $40? And so if somebody said, here, would you take this for $40? I don't think so. Because the only thing that I'm really happy about is this eyeshadow palette. And like the bubble bath. I wish it was bigger though. And you know, then if I had to pick like, it's okay. You know, would I, would I purchase this if I had the money? No, but I'm glad to get it in a subscription box. So I don't know, but it's not bad if that makes sense. So let me know what your thoughts are. Do you get this box? Do you like it? Do you think I'm being, uh, too harsh on this subscription let me know i'm definitely not going to cancel it's not where i'm like oh god i hate it so it's not that so i'll keep it for a few more months but let me know what you think i, I don't know if i'm just comparing it to the very first box that we got three eyeshadows and it was so good so i don't know if that's what i'm doing you know what i mean i don't know let me know your thoughts 
All right, guys, please like this video. It really does help me out or dislike it. That helps me out as well. Make sure you have your post notification bell on because I will be doing a get ready with me with the eyeshadow palette and a few other things that I got in other boxes. And yeah, that's everything, guys. Stay beautiful, stay blessed, stay healthy, and most importantly, always stay you. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys. I don't know. See, I just got done unboxing the bomb mystery box that, you know, wasn't that great. So I don't know if I'm just in a mood or what, but I don't know what I, 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 I don't know how I'm feeling, but we'll try you out another month. I mean, it can all be great. You know what I'm saying?